Hello, hello, hello. This is Mike Reed. Today's date is Monday, September 25th, 2023. I know that the other guys are going to start up in about 10, 15 minutes. So I just wanted to go over real quick the, the Duluth trading, the fire hose. Flex fire hose, right? These are on sale. I used to, I used to wear, oh, there we go. I used to wear the flex fire hose. So this is the ones that are on sale right now for like 40 bucks. Let me go over this way. Yeah, because this needs to do better with that black. These are the ones on sale right now for 40 bucks. Which are which are really good. They're really good pants. Uh, only problem I have is that they they fade. So you gotta you gotta color. You gotta uh, scotch guard them. You got to scotch guard them. So here's the bottom. The bottoms aren't frayed. Not like Dickies. Uh, I switched to Dickies, and Dickies are fraying. Uh, these Dickies are fraying. You can't really see that. So these are done. I actually had switched to Milwaukee. So I have the shirts. I have the shirts and everything like that. I did have Milwaukee pants. And the Milwaukee pants kind of let me down. First set got bleached. And then uh, they actually took those back. They actually took those back, refunded my money. Let me get more. So now I, I got the Milwaukee pants and I um, I scotch guard. Went and bought... Not just a regular scotch car, but I went and got the scotch car for like car seats and then sprayed those. So they're they're comparable to the to the Duluth trading. Only problem is the knees gave out. My Milwaukee pants, and I wanted to get some to show you my, my Milwaukee pants. I actually had to dye them. I had to dye them again. I bought some gray dye to dye them back. I bought the pants back when they first came out. January of uh, actually of this year. This is the black on the on the Duluth trading. Here we go. This is the black. Like my size was 32, 32. This I actually got big. This was like 34, 34, 32, but 32, 32 for my size is just fine. So the black, the black were pretty good. They did fade. But they, um, I didn't have as much problem with color. I mean, with the with acid and stuff like that bleaching them. But the Milwaukee pants, they did, and I kept them just to do a, a comparison. So I'm gonna do another one and, and do that. So let me let me show you. Let me show you the deal that's going on right now because those pants are really really expensive. Gonna add this to the screen. This is for another video. I want to show you guys the uh, some of the equipment in Firehouse subs, but that's gonna have to that's gonna have to wait. Let me see here. The loop trading. All right, here we go. I don't know what you guys are using for uniform pants, but I like the look of Duluth. Duluth was able to give me a contractor look. Not, not a technician look, but more of a contractor. It was, it was more, here we go. So they got the Duluth fire hose, whatever the RLX fit is. Relax fit. Okay, relax fit cargo. And so that's what uh some of these are. So I've been through I've been through a number of different different pants. So here they go. 50 bucks. Fifty bucks is what they're going for. 
All right, let's see here. Ah, it's not showing too well, but it's just the loop. Let me make this even bigger. So normally the pants are seventy nine dollars, and yes, the color the color choices are still there. So that's the black you've seen. Well, mine doesn't look so black anymore. That's the black, the khaki. I I opted for the gray and the black. And it does look like they still have. All right, they still got 32 32s left. They even got the, the precious 33. Yeah, you can go with 33 32s in the waist. But I'm a 32 32. The 34 in length is just way too long. If you're six feet tall, the 30, that 34 is for like somebody like six. Ooh, it is it is really long. <laughs> it is really long. All right, so let's show you here. Now I went with the I never went with the blue. Oh man. And the reason why I'm showing you this, I don't know how long this sale is. I think the sale is just today. But the reason for me to show you this is because they're trying to compete with the Milwaukee. So the Milwaukee pants. All right, so Milwaukee pants sold through Home Depot and a couple other places too are regularly forty nine dollars. Oh, they don't have thirty two, thirty two. So the only problem with the Milwaukee, they don't have black. They just got that gray. And like I said, mine faded. I ended up. I end up in a situation where I end up having to buy some great dye, and I end up having to dye mine. So that's my that's my gripe with um, my gripe with Milwaukee. And then, I, man, I want to show you my sizes and everything. So I'll have to do another video. I have to do another video. But I bought the very first. I believe. I believe. Don't hold me to this, but I believe these are made by by Brunt. The pants are very, very similar. The seam, the stitching, the way the pockets are, it is, it's like 98% the same. They just made a couple of changes here or there that weren't significant. But if you're if you're into the uniform uh look of the of this style, I stand by it. I like it. It's just that the problem that the that the Milwaukee pants have is that they wear at the knees. I did not have that problem with the Duluth trading. So if you're on the fence, it's 49 for for the Milwaukee and it's and it's 50 for the Duluth. I just for today, I believe. So if you're going to restock on your uniform and you go with Duluth, now is the time. All right. With that. I'll check you guys out later.